This is a binary calculator that I created using a program called the Fun Physics Sandbox. And the Fun Physics Sandbox is a really awesome application that you can use to create uh, physical uh, contraptions and then run them through, you know, a very a very simplified but very powerful physics engine so you can create like tanks and stuff too so uh, details over there on the right in the descriptions please uh, for all you engineers and geeks who want to know much more about this uh, check out the details uh, for the rest of you I'm just going to show off this this calculator and explain a little what a calculator does so as you can see we've got five kind of columns we got one two three four five each column has one of these white top looking things in it and uh, if we zoom in on one of them, you get an idea of exactly what this is. It's sort of like a rocker thing, and as you can see, it defaults to the left side there because it has a little spring right here. Well, what this is, is is a bit, and a bit is either on or off. And in this case, off is to the left, on is to the right. Off, off, on. So what makes this special is that when the rocker is to the left, it expresses a zero, or off. When it's to the right, it expresses a one or an on. And as you watch this, you'll start to see exactly how binary works and what it means to add in binary. And the way we make the rockers turn on and off is by dropping little marbles down into the machine. And here are the marbles. Kind of cool, a little bucket of marbles there. And what we're going to do is drop these marbles into the machine one by one and start to add the numbers together. Now before I do that, I want you to think about your hand and your fingers, and when you were a kid how you would express uh, numbers using your fingers. You'd probably pull out your right hand and say, one, two, three, four, five, and you'd put up your thumb for one, your index finger for two, so on and so forth, and you'd get to five. And then when you had to count further, you'd probably pull out your other hand and go six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then if you were witty like I was when I was a kid, you would then pull out your toes and say eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and so forth. But the truth is, on your one hand, you can count to five easily, but you can actually count to a much higher number. You can actually count to 31, because you don't have to just use one finger to denote one number. You can hold up two individual fingers, you can hold up three fingers at once, and they can be any of the three fingers. And that's exactly what this binary calculator does. You've got finger one, finger two, finger three, finger four, finger five, which are down. Now I'm going to call these rockers, because that's really what they are. They rock left to the right. I'm going to call them the bits in the binary calculator. And as we add, we add right to left. Or I'm sorry, we add left to right. So we add 16, 8, 4, 2, and 1. Right now everything's set to 0, so it's 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0. And of course it equals 0. So let's start adding some numbers. All right, let's, let's create the number 1. So we take this marble and we drop it down into the number 1 slot. Now you can take a look and see that the rocker is set to the right, which is on, and the marble is there. So we have 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 1, which is 1. So let's add 4 to that for a, number, for a total of 5. So now we have the 5 bit, or I'm sorry, the 4 bit on, so 4 plus 1 equals 5. Now let's add 2 to that for 7. Bink! Now we have 7. 0 plus 0 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1 equals 7. Now if we add 1 to 7, what do we get? We get the number 8, of course. Now the number 8 is represented by this column here. So if we were to add 1 to this number, we probably would see the 1, the 2, and the 4 bit clear, and the 8 bit open. Let's find out. So we go boom, boom, boom. There we are. So now it's 0 plus 8 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0, which is 8, of course. The number here is represented by the binary 0, 1, 0, 0, 0. So let's, uh, let's add uh, 4 to 8, which is 12. Let's add 2 to 12, which is 14. Hey, right, now we have represent the number 14. Now let's add 1 to that for 15. Representing the number 15 by showing your fingers as off, on, 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 on. You can look at that as saying your pinky's down, and the rest of your f four fingers are up. So we have 15. If we added 4 to 15, that equals 19. So let's add 4 to 15 and see what happens. Boom, boom, boom. So we should have 19 now, right? Well, let's find out. 16 plus 0 plus 0 plus 2 plus 1 equals 19. There you go. Pretty easy. So, if I were to add 1 to this, we'd have 20. Alright, so 16 plus 0 plus 4 plus 0 plus 0 equals 20. Awesome. Let's add 1 to that, so it's 21. 2 to that, so it's 23. 
Now we've got 23 represented by on, off, on, 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 or 16 plus 0 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1. And uh, let's uh, drop, whoops, move my home. Let's drop this down and see what happens. Doop, doop, doop. All right, now we've got 24 represented by 16 plus 8 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0. It's kind of like your pinky and your ring finger up and the rest of your fingers down and counting. So there you go, you can kind of get the idea of binary. Now of course the thing that everyone likes to see is when you cascade all the numbers. Whoops! It's not perfect, you know. Let's uh, fill up all the numbers. So the largest possible number you can represent would be all the fingers up, all the rockers turned on, all ones. So 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, which is 16 plus 8 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1, which equals 31. Well, this calculator can only count the 31. It can't count past that. So if you were to add one to this number, what would end up happening is, is you would end up happening, or you would end up having the calculator reset to zero. So here we go. And as you can see, the calculator resets to zero. Now just to kind of give a cool little finale to this, what I like to do is pause the calculator, move the marble up here, get a good nice view of it. We're gonna follow this bad boy. We're gonna turn the speed down. It's pretty cool. You ready? You ready? You ready? Alright. Let's do it. I love watching this. So much fun. Yes! There goes the 1 bit. Here comes the 2 bit. Uh, clear the 2 bit. Here comes the 4 bit. Uh, we've got the 4 bit cleared. 8 bit cleared. And here's the 16 bit. 16 bit's cleared. And there they go.